Hi, I'm Kelly Ritchie. Today, we are going to look at vibrato. Vibrato is just yet another form of punctuation. Um, so I'm in the key of A. I'm on my lower strings. See how my hand is? As opposed to if I'm up here on my higher strings, I'll let the edge of the guitar neck rest right here between where my index finger meets the knuckle, meets the palm of my hand here. And I'll just pivot back and forth. See how my thumb's not locked down? It could be. Just kind of as a guide or stability. Here, I'm kind of pulling down. I'm pulling my hand up and down. But I'm doing so with my hand leveraged up against the neck. So it's part turning and part pulling down. Whereas here is all pivoting. Okay, this would be like this. This is a great thing to throw into the end of a phrase. It doesn't have to be a long phrase. So, one thing that you can practice is... Now, I probably would never really play vibrato with my pinky. First and third. See how I've got my thumb leveraged? You might want to go through the whole thing with your thumb leveraged build up hand strength and just to get the feel in the tips of your fingers. Here you're going to be kind of pushing up in general before you start to agitate the string or you'll come right off the neck. Here I've got my first finger locked in and I'm practicing it this way. But really going through scales practicing this is not extremely practical. Really just kind of getting used to doing it in those sweet spots on the guitar here. This is probably the most used note. vibrato that I play. And sometimes I'll push a string up if I'm on the high string. Okay? Have fun with that. Incorporate that into your playing. Vibrato is critical. And it can just be a slow vibrato. Doesn't have to be fast. So practice slow Fast, slow, fast. I like practicing things on the acoustic guitar. It makes me work harder. It makes me really have to hear the sustain. Practice on an electric guitar unplugged. Really makes you hear the sustain. When you plug it in, it's not like that's really cheating, but when you're really trying to find these things and get control of these things, uh, unplugging your electric and, and practicing will show you what that electric sounds like. And that's critical because that's what you're amplifying. You're amplifying your hands and what it is that you're pulling out of this guitar. Okay? All right. Good luck to you. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Kelly Ritchie.